Police in Kinshasa push back opposition leader Moise Katumbi and his supporters. The crowds are trying to reach the Electoral Commission building in the Congolese capital. From now on, President Felix Chisekedi must know that we will be coming here every Thursday to protest against what they are doing with the elections process until we have free and credible elections in the country. Protesters are demanding an international audit of the entire Electoral Commission. We are here to say no to the ongoing electoral process which the current president is trying to fix for himself and his people. We refuse this with all our energy. This is why we are protesting. President Felix Chesakedi won disputed elections in 2019. Critics say since then he's consolidated his power by hand-picking loyalists to run the Electoral Commission and accuse him of appointing judges who are biased. Amnesty International and other rights groups have also accused him of declaring a state of siege in the eastern North Kivu and Ituri provinces to crack down on dissent. These are areas known to be opposition strongholds. What Felix and his people are doing is unacceptable in a state which is supposed to be a democracy. People have died in this country for freedom. And we will not accept a dictatorship now. Governing party supporters dismiss such protests as an attempt to discredit the government. Elections are scheduled to take place in December. Thousands of opposition protesters say they'll keep up the pressure to ensure a fair process. Victoria Gatenby, Al Jazeera.